First, detach the lens shade by pressing the silver tab underneath. If your second lens doesn't come with filter basket, you need to remove it too. Use the flat disc located near the front of the lens. Simply turn it counterclockwise to release lens front door. Gently take the basket out. If your second lens already have the filter basket mounted, you can skip this step. Turn the lens mounting ring into the direction showed by arrow. Open the camera door. Press and hold down the silver button. Twist the lens counterclockwise, and gently pull it out. Now it's the time to mount the new lens. But before, unscrew the zoom stick from the old lens. And place it on the new one. Now, blow any dust off. Place the filter basket and close the front door. Now the lens. Remember to match bayonet with the notches in the lens mount. Gently push the lens in and twist it clockwise. Then turn the lens ring also clockwise. Attach lens shade. Remember to adjust it to focal length of your lens. That's it. You have successfully changed the lens. Changing the viewfinder is even easier. Turn black dial counterclockwise. And pull the viewfinder while gently turning it up and down. This is so called swan neck viewfinder. It makes handheld work possible and comfortable, to some degree. Let's mount it. All you need to do is open the camera door. And gently push viewfinder in place. Secure it by turning black dial clockwise. Then straighten viewfinder. Close the door and you're done. Isn't it easy? Just remember, never use it as a carrying handle. If your swan neck viewfinder lacks the eyepiece no problem. Just swap it with the one from regular viewfinder. Problem solved.